Hello everyone, and welcome to my General Hospital Today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Curtis Ashford will struggle after being transferred from GH to his new rehab institution, according to General Hospital spoilers. This is a vital step in Curtis' recovery, but he is still angry and afraid about the future. Going to this treatment facility will compel Curtis to face reality, which will bring on a whole new set of difficult feelings. Curtis will struggle to cope, but he will receive assistance from a physical therapist named Roy along the way. There will be lots of other patients going through similar experiences as Curtis, so knowing he's not alone may help. Roy may also remind Curtis that the work he is willing to put in will determine his quality of life. Curtis may not be able to influence whether or not he walks again, but he can still put in some effort in physical therapy to give himself the best chance of progress. Of course, Portia Robinson, Brooke Kerr, hopes they can progress in their marriage as well. That's why Portia will show up unexpectedly at recovery and try to coerce Curtis into having a talk he's been avoiding. Curtis did his best to keep Portia afar, acting as if they should dissolve their marriage, since he's not the same man he used to be. Portia, on the other hand, adores Curtis' heart and is determined to break past his defenses. Portia previously rebuffed Curtis' attempt to drive her away, but she'll have to work a little harder if she wants to secure their future together. Curtis would definitely lash out if Portia shows up at his treatment facility against his desires. Curtis may reaffirm his desire to be alone, but Portia would see it as detrimental to both of them. Instead, Portia will beg Curtis to just let her in and acknowledge the love she still has for him. Although Portia believes they can face this problem together, Curtis may not share her perspective. Portia will try to assist Curtis in his recuperation, but Curtis' stubbornness may cause more complications as this tale progresses. Curtis will be updated on Portia's position, according to General Hospital teasers, so keep tuned for more on whether he'll accept her help. Is Essam going to be the new face of deception? According to General Hospital spoilers, Essam Prince will be the new face of deception. For some reason, fans believe that this will occur. Continue reading to find out more. Spoilers for General Hospital. Essam Price is the new face of deception. Essen could be the new face of deception, according to General Hospital spoilers. The cosmetics company is failing and could benefit from a makeover. On the SoapCentral.com message boards, user Sue24 asked, Will Essen be the next face of deception? I'd like to see Essen hang out with the deception women during their meals, clash meetings and bond with them a little. They've all done pretty terrible things and are now reformed, the user stated. Since Esm wants to be a model, she might clash with Trainer Robinson, Tabiana Ali. Esm could begin as an assistant to Maxie Jones, Culliston Storms. That's how Esm learns about Trainer. I'd rather Esm stayed at the Invader, got her degree, and became a journalist in Alexis and the Davis Girls' orbit. However, a big glamorous storyline is always entertaining, the user continued. Will Esm face off with Trainer on GH? Fans of General Hospital turn to the forum to express themselves. Most of them could imagine Essen clashing with Trina, who was always trying to push her way up the corporate ladder. Some suggested that the firm look for someone other than Essen. No. Pod Essen has never paid for her crimes or apologized to any of her victims. She will never be rewarded with a position like that. She already had her amnesia get out of jail free card, one supporter contended. Essen caused significant harm to others. She was vicious and wicked. I can't accept her in anything until she accepts responsibility for something. She's having her greatest life right now and shouldn't be rewarded, another remarked. Some general hospital viewers believe Essen has paid for her actions in some way. Pandas 1981 posted on another topic. I think Essen has paid for her crimes in some way. If she has no memory, she hasn't even paid that way, but no she hasn't paid, one person remarked, she's uninteresting with or without her memories. 
General hospital rumors indicate that Anna Devane will tell Valentine Cassadine about how someone wants her to pay for what she did on Monday, August 14. Despite the fact that Anna is a target, it appears that she will downplay some of Valentin's worries. Anna might not believe her life is in immediate danger because the person who started the fire did it while she was outside the house. Anna might believe that someone is intentionally trying to terrify her now, despite what occurred at the pool. At GH, Austin Gatlin Holt will reportedly wish to sever his relationship with Mason Gatlin and pursue other interests. Mason will, however, ponder his bizarre decision to release Austin. Since the boss plainly sees value in keeping Austin's skills as a doctor, this isn't Austin or Mason's decision to make. Olivia Quartermain will express her frustration with the Eddie Main incident to Dante Falconeri at the Metro Court pool as he wonders whether she will give up on Ned Quartermain. Olivia may be concerned that Eddie won't ever change back into Ned, but Dante believes she should keep up the fight for him and their future as a couple. We'll see if Ned goes seeking for Olivia or someone else when he eventually reappears. Carly Spencer will converse with Josephine Jacks about the bar brawl and how she came to be detained at the PCPD in the meantime. When Carly informs Jocelyn that Sonny Corinthos tried to sign her out but was unsuccessful, even Joss would conclude that her mother was being a little too obstinate. In any event, Jocelyn ought to ultimately secure Carly's release and learn of her mother's mounting concerns. In the Monday's GH teaser video, Carly warns Jocelyn that, if he loses power, we're no longer safe. It appears that Carly will be concerned about Sonny and any potential risks he may be facing. Carly might believe that it is more crucial than ever for Dex Heller, Evan Hofer, to gather all the information he can and inform Michael Corinthos, Chad Duell. Dex will meet with Sonny and inquire about the strategy. Given that he's preparing to construct a trap for someone, Sonny will have a challenging new mission for Dex. That might be a response to Anna's most recent drama, but Betty Rutherford, Ella Lentini, could also be involved since Sonny is hoping she can help him find out more information about her enigmatic boss. Ava and Grace Scarola's Avery Corinthos were meant to be taken to camp by Betty, but it appears Sonny will confront her and claim that things have changed. Maybe Sonny will set up some bait in front of Betty and watch to see what she does after that. Betty will eventually present a progress report, so she may meet with Mason or another employee of the company they both work for. Dex may be required to follow Betty and inform Sonny of her shady activities, which puts his life in danger if he is apprehended. According to general hospital teasers, Sonny will keep giving Dex commands and placing him in precarious situations as a result. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.